Last week, you guys had questions. This week, we have the answers. The most popular question came from viewers such as Gobo915 and Tristan McKay, who were wondering how we do what we do. Once a news story is selected, a writer, typically a native English speaker, will draft an animation script. To quickly address questions from Toady, Sody, and Toast Kid, we have about 8 Tomo News writers, plus Marijuana Man who's completely useless after 420. The script is then translated into Chinese by a project manager, before being passed on to a storyboard artist who sketches out the various scenes. For Mr. Ard247 and anyone else wondering about software, they use Adobe Illustrator. The 15-member animation team then meets with the writer and the project manager to discuss details of the animation. After the storyboard meeting, our modeling team starts building scenes and choosing avatars. Meanwhile, in another room, using software developed in-house, the motion capture team captures data for the actions we want to see in the animation, which is then passed on to our animators who use 3D Max, Maya, or After Effects to pair the motion capture data with the avatars from the modeling team. From there, it's up to our editors to put everything together in Premiere and add sound effects from stock and in-house libraries. The entire process from writing to rendering is completed in about three to four hours. There's your answer, Kevin Sakun about and asks, uh, well, how the hell am I supposed to pronounce that? Our second top question came from Jonathan Cepeda, who asked if we could animate Donald Trump getting kicked in the nuts by the Burger King. He then modified his request to see if we could show the Burger King shoot Trump and Kim Jong-un off a bird with a rocket launcher. We couldn't decide which scenario was more hilarious, so we decided to animate them both. Enjoy! Tune in next time when we tackle our Tomo girls. Or rather, we'll explain how these complete strangers end up on our channel. Leave an insightful comment on Tomonews.net and you could win up to $500 every month.